In these few minutes, we're going to be talking about emergency information, particularly on Android. Very important topic to stay safe. If you open up an Android, it looks like this with a keypad and hopefully a red banner at the top that says emergency information. This video is about emergency information on Android and a lock screen message, which may help. As background context all over the planet, you can see tons of things about emergency. Of course, the red medic the green cross for medicine and I particularly like this one on the right hand side which is a ship's radio room clock about sending out SOS and timings. That is context. So moving on with more context on a local old fashioned level quite honestly is this thing in the UK that's local to me and that is it's a message in a bottle where you literally have a little bottle that you store in your refrigerator and you can fill out all the details like name, address, weights, medications in case of emergency who to phone that sort of thing even your carer now if we move on to exactly on android and i'm using android 7 we open up with a screen like this when you double tap or tap emergency information what you actually get is a mock-up here with my name where i live at 123 any street townsville and a person to contact with a phone number. That's when it's set up, but often, and I bet you, you haven't done this, me included, apart from today. So let's talk through it. So in my test account, top left, we have Android. When you try and get into that, in my account, you're presented with a nine grid, and of course you won't know the pattern because it's an emergency. So you tap the word emergency at the bottom and it opens up this. Then you go again, and this time you can tap if it is red and it actually works and you tap again and you might find nothing. To set it up what you can do is click the pencil on the top right hand side and you'll get this screen saying emergency information you can set it up. So let's just go through some mock screens. Before you set it up it asks for name address, blood type, allergies, medications, whether you want to be an organ donor. More importantly, I particularly like the medical notes where you can just put in some notes or anything that you find useful whatsoever. Then on the right hand side, you can add a contact. In my mock up, I'm actually making some contacts here that I can choose from Mary James, Patricia, John and Elizabeth, all fictitious. And then you can go in and you can type in after that, of course, your name, uh, maybe your blood types. This is, a, say, a fast walkthrough of this. Add some medical notes and then you have it finished. And it may look like this on the right hand side that you've just seen and I've just showed you. Then, taking a step back, there may be, and in mine is a Moto G4, some in-device help. The way you can actually find out and educate yourself about this important topic, in my phone at least, to find the help screens is by clicking Moto Help and then learn, and then I found it best to click the magnifying glass and search keyword emergency, and then how to set up emergency information and what's new in Nugget. When you get to that, what you find is a couple of screens, Android Nugget is the thing, and then third bullet point emergency information. This is all background information to compare to your own phone. In the emergency information section, settings users emergency information, you do have a lock screen message as well. I've always set that up and set this up for quite a long time. And in my own phone, this is my main account look, I get a rolling scroll of my public facing Gmail and also my YouTube account, which kind of guy gives my name. If I wanted to edit it, it would look like this. And then you find that by going into the settings and then you go through to um, screen lock settings, security, screen lock settings, and then lock screen message, and then fill one in and save it. So what else we got to do? I think we've come to the end of this. So really, really important. Stay safe, people. And remember, emergency information on the making of this video, even if I reach one person who tells another person that either helps someone to alert a first responder or quite honestly they might be the one in need of help then a job worth doing thanks very much see you next time